From VOA Learning English, this is Health. More than 5,000 members of the Pakistani security forces have been killed fighting terrorists and militants since 2001. Twice as many regular and paramilitary troops have been wounded. But the high number of deaths and injuries has resulted in improved care at the Army's top rehabilitation center in Rawalpindi. Doctors at the rehabilitation center help injured troops regain physical and mental skills damaged in war. Aman Ula lost both of his legs more than a year ago while serving in the Khyber tribal area on the border with Afghanistan. The 23-year-old is one of the thousands of Pakistani soldiers dealing with wounds from Pakistan's fight against militant groups. Most soldiers are wounded by improvised explosive devices, or IEDs. The soldiers are recovering from major medical operations at Rawalpindi's Armed Forces Institute for Rehabilitation Medicine, or AFIRM. Aman Ula and several other soldiers are now hoping to compete in the next Paralympic Games. This international competition is for athletes with disabilities. The chief of the Rehabilitation Center says he is proud of the progress made in treating the patients. The experience of treating thousands of patients over the years has led to improved medical practices. These improvements include more useful artificial limbs to replace arms and legs lost to injuries. Medical workers have also developed other improved practices for helping wounded soldiers. There are plans to expand the Rawalpindi Rehabilitation Center. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.